I'm Captain Shelby Chapman. I am the Director of Operations for the Cultural Engagement Team that's been set up here um, for Operation Allies Refuge here at Ramstein Air Base. Our entire job is to facilitate communication with our Afghan populace here on base and also with our airmen and soldiers who are supporting our Afghan populace here on base. As CET, we just call it the SET, um, we are comprised of public affairs personnel, um, Army Special Forces personnel, USAID, Army Civil Affairs, Information Operations. Honestly, everyone facilitates communication in a different way and brings a different skill set to the table. I'm uh, assigned to the 361st Civil Affairs Brigade. Uh, we've been activated to come here and provide intercultural communication support to the Air Force. Um, and so mostly what I'm doing is liaising between the Air Force and the Afghan people, between the Army and the Air Force, and then between interagency organizations such as USAID uh, and the Army. This has been like one of the largest uh, learning curves for us. Uh, so this is an Air Force-led operation. Um, and so us as Army soldiers, we've been integrating into their process and operation because the Air Force themselves don't have a civil affairs component. Um, and so there's been a, a, an amount of us, you know, explaining what it is that we do and how we can fit into their operational process and get out there and communicate with people um, because this is something that we do. When they infill, we say, hey, who, who do you want to represent you? Do, would you? do you have identified leaders within, you know, maybe the area that they're currently waiting in or something like that to help us communicate to them either what's going to happen next or to vice versa, let us know what they're actually needing. Giving that control and that power back to this population who just went through so much turmoil, these people need our care and our support and they're going through a situation that I hope nobody ever has to go through. And I think that all of our airmen and soldiers that are here doing that that's exactly what's driving them and so that's fueling me and my energy to do this every single day for however many hours it takes.